Hey guys, Tomboy61, and today it is that time of month again. It's Loot Crate time. Now, this month's theme is role models? With a question mark, because it's featuring people who maybe shouldn't be role models, but uh, they are anyway. So, uh, let's dive on in. There's the wonderful first look. We got what looks like some Deadpool, some Archer. So uh, let's go ahead and take a look at the shirt first. There we go. There's the shirt. Peekaboo! Awesome. So Deadpool, a taco shirt. His last shirt from uh, the last time we got a Deadpool shirt was like, tacos? So uh, I'm enjoying the theme that they're continuing on with here. That's pretty cool. That's exciting. Not as soft as a usual uh, Loot Crate shirt, which is kind of unfortunate, but I do tech definitely still love this. This is gonna, definitely going to have to be my default uh, Taco Tuesday shirt from now on, if you know what I mean. Next, we have an Archer classic figurine. So, there it is. It's uh, Archer chugging a beer saying one second. Uh, it comes with a nice little stand. We'll get him on that. There he is. I do have to say, it doesn't really look like Archer. Um, it definitely just looks like generic white dude number three that they like picked out of a pre-made like sculpted businessman thing and had him just hold a beer bottle um but i still like it like i still i i'm a big fan of archer so uh that's definitely still a really cool piece this month's pin is uh the big lebowski so uh there's that next up it looks like we have a child's wallet it is it is a child's wallet with a banana on it with a banana on it there's always money in the banana stand ah arrested development so it's an Arrested Development wallet. That's interesting. Like, who's going to use this? Because it feels cheap and childy. Like, I guess if you're a big Arrested Development fan, maybe you use this. But, like, I don't know. I've had the same leather wallet since 8th grade. And I love that wallet so much. And it feels great in my hand. And the patina on it is great. I'm not going to trade it in for a uh, thing like that. But... Hey, there we go. Looks like we got a Punisher sticker for like a car decal, like you put it on the inside of your thing, um, and it's the Punisher logo. I'm not a put stuff on my car kind of person, so uh, if you are, that's pretty cool. If you like the Punisher, that's great, but uh, if not, well, uh, sucks to suck, I guess. Then we have a small movie advertisement for uh, Deadpool, May 18th, long since passed, so uh, cool. Yay, you, the box shipped way after the movie debut. And, uh, then we have our little uh, sheet of what we got. So uh, there we go, guys. That is this month's Loot Crate. Overall, kind of disappointing. Like, the Archer figurine is passable. The shirt's cool. Could really care less about the wallet. Could really care less. Like, yeah, that's it's that's a mixed bag of a, of a loot box, I feel that's kind of that's kind of dumb and disappointing and stupid but uh hey sometimes you win sometimes you lose with loot crate I'm definitely looking forward to next month's loot crate because it got some Jurassic Park and some Godzilla stuff in it and uh, I'm all about that both of those things so uh, I'm definitely looking forward to next month's crate if you want to see me unbox that go ahead and hit that like button hit that subscribe button that way you know when all of my videos go live guys my name's Tommy Boy 61. I hope you have a great rest of your day. See ya.